Okay, guys, after uh, speaking to uh, Ernie and a few other builders, uh, it appears that even though there's a, it looks, what looks to be like a roll on the farm, actually appears caused by the, uh, the, I guess, the lifting of the leather here. So I can feel that it's not flush, so it's probably lifted. So I was told that to roll it on the rail, uh, that is to be able to see if you can see how straight the cue is. And surprisingly enough, when I roll this on a rail, and you can probably see, you know, the cue actually rolled dead straight, which is kind of weird. I mean, I don't know, maybe the roll is a little bit different, but I mean, if you roll it, you can see that now, like, there's not much movement. Like, normally you can tell from the roll of this whether the cue is straight or not. So, and then if you can watch now the movement of this on, on the, uh, I guess the, uh, the cue when I roll it, you can check here. See? It's actually dead straight, which is kind of strange. Like, you know, you can see there, you know, you roll it, you actually hit. So, really, the rollout here is because of the bulging on the leather. So, that leather piece here is actually, I can feel it here, is a little raised. So, when you put the, uh, the butt on, on itself, it kind of raised, the, the, I guess, the form or something. And, and it makes it. So, when you sight the cue, and you turn the cue from the handle down, and you turn it, it's actually dead straight. So, I don't know what to tell you, but uh, I think the cue is straight. I don't... I think all it is is maybe because of the wrap here that needs to be pressed. And maybe there's a slight movement, but uh, I mean like it's mine enough to be considered straight. So rolling like this, as most people usually test Q, you can see that the Q actually lo roll very, very straight. And I don't know how, how else to test this. So you can see here, if I can roll that, it's actually dead. Okay, now funny enough, if you take it out, The shaft is, of course, dead straight, but you take out the butt and you roll this by itself. Now you see that slight roll that I'm talking about. Okay, so you can see that movement there, but I think again it's caused by the wrap uh, bulging up here. So I think Ernie can probably fix that. I'm, I'm sure he's probably not going to have to replace the handle or anything, and probably just going to make sure the the I guess the wrap is flush, and then it'll be fine. So the cue is, you know. Uh, from my perspective anyway, you don't need to change anything. I mean, you know, rolling the way that I roll it just now, it is straight. And then playing with the cue is fine. And then when you roll it together, flat on the table, it does roll flat. So, I mean, it rolls dead flat. From the top, it looks dead straight. The only time is that when you look underneath, you can see a little bit of the, uh, I guess, uh, wobble or whatever. But I think it's most likely caused by the leather wrap. Alright, just want to shoot that video to show you.